Hey Beans, it's Ju, and today I am going to be filming a what's in my backpack tour. And um, I haven't filmed this in like a year or more from a few years ago, but I'm finally getting to it because I love watching them and I'm really proud of my backpack. That's another reason why. Um, I basically decorated it with all types of patches and pins, but I, uh, um, kind of, it was coming off, so I used some glue to fix it, and that happened on almost all the patches. But I'm so proud of it, so we'll just get on in to the tour. So up top, I have a small little pocket up here. And in here, wrong, wrong zipper. In here, I just keep my ID for work, which I can't show you, and my monthly Metro card, so I have easy access, my headphones, and my school ID, which I, well, yeah pretty bad but that's what I keep there I just keep those up there so that I can have easy access because to get into every building on campus I have to show my ID and to get into my job I need my ID so just need easy access then sorry for you my dog he's like playing with a, a straw I don't know the next two pockets that we're gonna get into are these two front pockets. I have a small one in the very front, and then I have a bigger one back here. So in this small one, I don't really keep much because the backs of pins are there because I keep the most pins on the front pouch. But in there, I keep a baby lips in the dark color just in case I need to put some, you know, tints on my lips and look good. If I'm going somewhere and I keep some tied to go because I literally use this all the time like I don't understand like how I eat or like I don't know but I'm always getting stains and this has saved my life multiple times it is like the best purchase ever so in this next pouch it has other pouches in it which I really really love um, and in there I just keep my wallet. I just keep my wallet. This wallet is so old, but it's still so good. It holds everything I need. And I just keep it in there. I don't use it for like things that I need quick access to because it's just too much to pull out my wallet and then like go through it and then pull out my ID to show, you know, security. But I put everything else in there and that's literally all I have in this front pocket one of the things I don't like about this backpack is that it doesn't have a water bottle holder on the side like there's nothing there so that is the downside to this backpack if I want to bring a water bottle I literally have to like put it in a bag and then put it in my backpack just in case it leaks or something so in my backpack, I have a cardigan that I sometimes bring with me. Then the next thing in my bag is this Imagining Native Peoples book. And it is just a book that we are using for my uh, Native American literature class. It has a whole bunch of stuff. And I use post-it notes for literally everything. It keeps me organized and I love them. Going along with the readings, I have Beloved by Toni Morrison and The Lone Ranger and Tonto Fistfight in Heaven. Um, these are also books that I'm reading in some of my classes. This one is for my Native American literature class and this is for my Escape, Captivity, and the Inescapable in American literature class. That is a mouthful, okay? Then I have my two notebooks. This one's more for quick notes and just jotting things down. It is a mess inside. And then this one is my more structured notebook that has like each class tabbed and 
where all my notes go if I'm rewriting or if I'm studying or things that actually need to look nice. That's where all this goes. Then I have my two homework folders. Um, they both have really cute sayings on them. And I use both of them because I get so much homework that one of them just can't hold everything I get. Then I have this folder. It is a folder that has like multiple folders inside that are like really pretty and dividers. Dividers? And this is all the work that I've gotten since the beginning of the semester that we're not using anymore. That's old and I don't have to constantly have it with me. So I just put it in here and if they ever ask me to pull it out randomly, I'll have it. But I don't want to mix it with the stuff that I know is current and will be due and I will need in class, like for sure. Next, I have my iPad. I don't always bring my iPad with me to school, but I do when I have a reading because I have the apps where my textbooks are. And um, for long gaps, this is really helpful because I can sit and have this out and open since this is like a prop and it's just really nice to have but i only bring it on days when i know i'm going to use it because i can't keep having things in my backpack that's going to take up space if i'm not going to use it that day then i have my planner this is the best planner i've had in my life so far it's kept me super organized it has a ton of things that just help me stay on track and i am just super 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 in love with this planner it is literally the best thing and it keeps me so organized the last thing in my backpack is my pencil case um i have some stray pens that i just throw away in my backpack after class um but yeah this is my pencil case i've had it for quite some time now probably a few years but it's still my favorite it's by the brand yobi or yubi whatever you want to pronounce it as but i love it it has this huge compartment for all of my pens and then it has these two front pockets where i keep uh just some post-its and some paper clips and just everything i need and honestly i probably take too many pens with me to school but it, it's super handy like i love this pencil case it's the best thing ever and that is everything in my backpack i hope you enjoyed seeing everything that i keep in my backpack i try to keep it very minimal and just bring what i need um so yeah don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it click here to subscribe and click here to watch some of my other videos so i will see you in my next video bye